Hello everyone, my name is Vikas Maheshwari. I passed out of NIIT about 22 years back uh, and my NIIT journey probably is not very different from the million others that NIIT has trained. I'd read some advertisements about NIIT and I'd walked into the NIIT center to find out more. Uh, and I remember that one, one and a half hour of conversation that I had with Mrs. Amandeep Sekhon, who was the counselor at the center at that point of time. She spoke to me about, you know, uh, what computers was, what the industry was all about, and where it was headed and how, you know, exciting a career in computers and in IT at that point of time could be. Uh, and, 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 and I then decided that, okay, well, if that's what it is, then let me try and, and, and be a part of this whole revolution. I'm talking about 94, 95, so, you know, it was, it was probably at the cusp of, you know, of the time when the revolution in IT was just about to begin. Uh, I, I did a three years NIIT program, which, which was called a GNIIT. And uh, after having completed that course, you know, there was no looking back. Uh, today, after 22 years, I'm, I'm driving a digital transformation and HR transformation for a very large retail group in the Middle East. Uh, and, and all thanks to NIIT that there are certain skill sets that I think I was able to acquire, which have stayed with me uh, all throughout. Uh, and one of those, uh, I don't know if that, if that still happens at the NIIT courses, but it was called uh, ISAS, Information Search and Analysis Skills. Uh, it was an amazing experience because, you know, that was one part of the course which would prepare you to be able to search information uh, on a subject that you've never heard of on your own. Uh, and after doing that research, you know, present a paper uh, not just to your classmates, but also probably to your parents, to industry experts, and so on and so forth. Uh, my ISS project at that point of time was uh, morphing, uh, which was about, you know, uh, how pictures can be morphed and videos can be morphed. And I had no clue about what that was. So when I started doing the research, I realized, well, what morphing really was. And I, and I remember when I had to present the entire paper uh, to a whole lot of people, I was very, very nervous. But... But that experience of, of having completed ISAS, uh, you know, and, and had done a good job, I think, at it, gave me a lot of confidence. And, and that's one skill, which is about research and search, and then, of course, about presenting your ideas to people and to stakeholders. That has stayed with me uh, all through those 22 years. Uh, and, and, and I think, uh, you know, that's one of the ingredients of success, where you can present your ideas, where you can always upskill yourself by doing active research, and, and uh, not depend only on, you know, uh, information that is um, handed over to you, but also probably go out and, and do your own self-study. Uh, so, so here's it, guys. I mean, I, 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 I really think that NIIT has done a lot for me. I think uh, a lot part of my success is all thanks to NIIT. And I'm sure that many others like me and some of the NIIT, you know, classmates that I'm in touch with feel pretty much the same way. Uh, so here's wishing NIT all the best and uh, I hope uh, they keep on churning amazing successful professionals uh, you know into the industry as they've always done. So goodbye folks.